We're now at the P bars. So we're not going to go too much into skill work today. We're just going to start with some basic conditioning because it's very upper body heavy. And if you haven't got a lot of upper body strength, you're going to struggle to um, do any of the skills. So the first thing we're going to have Joe do today is you're going to jump up. Yeah. And you're going to do what's called a penguin walk. Okay. So you can jump up. You don't want saggy shoulders. You want your shoulders as far away from your ears as possible. And once you're up, you're just going to tilt to the side, trying to keep those shoulders pressed down the whole time, all the way to the end. Yeah, good. Squeeze your legs. <laughs> Squeeze your feet. That's it. Just arms in, drop down. There you go. Just put them straight in. <laughs> the next thing's penguin hop. So similar thing, except this time instead of waddle. You're gonna full on jump. You're gonna reset. Try not to swing too much. Where are you jumping from? Is it your are your shoulders getting you the thing? Is it a swing? Is it your arms? It's a little bit of everything really. But in a perfect world, you wouldn't really bend your arms that much, you just yeah. shrug down. But it's a combination of like a little hip thrust and a swing. And a, and a push on your shoulders. So like you sort of compress like through the shoulders, like that. What? And that's what sends you up. So struggle all the way down. Like yeah, and then hit frost and slow up. Yeah, that's it. Good man. The mastery of these really basic just um, traveling exercises is going to put you in a really good position when you start doing swings and other skills. Um, there's hundreds of ways you can travel along these if you want. You can in. Uh, raise one end of the bars up, so you go uphill or downhill. Uh, kids in particular enjoy that. And it just obviously makes it a lot harder if you're going uphill. Yeah. <laughs> 